in the next two weeks, I could be graduating. You know, it's Hoko week. Here's the problem. Um, Jill's really good at this. Um, I'm not. Is this. Oh, cool. Right. Okay. Just got a haircut. We're gonna put that away. A little short on top. Katie just found out today what she got in the circus. <laughs> Okay, so the day in which to excel, here we are. It is a, you know, it's Hoko week, and uh, Ryan Ardo is uh, preparing for big night tonight. Tonight is bonfire night, Thursday mm -hmm. night bonfire night, and here's his preparation. He's uh, got Callie's food there. He's got the Cali tater tots, the Cali beans, and the Ryan Ardo mom chicken tenders. We're going to go get, I'm going to go like that pretty soon. Here. Uh, I can't wait. We got a match of blue dress, so that's what we're going to go do. And um, and then I'm heading over. I need the bonfire at 6:30. This is my committee, so I'm really in charge of putting this on. And uh, so I gotta be there an hour early to, to help out. Excellent. Good. Cowboy boots for Western night. White shoes for Hoko. Mm -hmm. We're on our way. Let's do it. So I have this suit, and there's pants under here. Sharp threads. Um, and then a white shirt underneath. Let me see the liner. What? Yeah. Silky, right? Killer. Come on. So uh, I don't know what I want to wear, though. I don't know if I want to wear a whole suit. Um, I so think we'll it's see. good to wear a suit. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. I mean, um, we need to see if it matches with her dress, though. So, oh, right, right, right. And it's a blue dress, so we don't want it to clash. Right. But but we don't know what color blue, because the I'm not sure about the... Could you ask her to like, send a better lit picture than... Yeah. And we'll bring it with us. So here's the problem. Um, Jill's really good at this. Um, I'm not. So Ryan and I are going to go learn together. Yeah, we're, we're going to go figure it out. Yeah, we, we might, can we phone in mom for some <laughs> Right, right. That's a good idea. Yeah. And then there's those shoes. I mean, those would be... Oh, my gosh. I think that those would be killer. That's awesome. Right? Yeah. The inside of those. Right? Yeah, fantastic. Uh, and uh, looks like Alice has got it. Come on, bud. Come on through. There's Ed. He wants to come in. Hey. Come on, cat training. Ready? And one. Take a look. Zappa. Zappa. Come on, bud. Ready. Come on. Ed. No, that's not gonna help. There you go. Push. Nope. No. That's not the right door. That's our Alice. door. Alice, show him. Alice, show him what's up. Come on, bud. Yep, you got it. Oop, line it up. Yep. There's the push. Oop. No, that's not good. Mm -mm. When cats go through like uh, spaces, yes, they, they're very cautious, aren't they? Okay. Over here. What else? You got it. Push. Jeez. I know you know. <laughs> yeah, but come on. See, it looks like it looks like that they, they try to pretend like they're not paying attention. Yeah. Right, here we go. Here we go. Oh no. <laughs> There's Rhino and her driving. X doing an excellent job driving. Thank you. Driving to Nordstrom Rack. That's where we're going. We're gonna see if we can find a bow tie. A little royal blue bow tie action. We're gonna piece together this fit <laughs> one by one, and it's gonna be beautiful. Fantastic. Yeah. Exciting. Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the vlog. I have no idea if this is the beginning of a vlog, an end of a vlog. I've just been filming little pieces here and there. I'm Jill, and if you haven't watched us before, I am going through flight attendant training at Southwest Airlines, and I'm very, very excited about it. This is a whole new, like, second career, maybe third kind of career thing for me. Um, my family is at home my husband and our son Ryan who is 17 in high school and we have two kids in college and they have been cheering me on as I have my parents my brothers and sisters everybody's been cheering me on which is really very nice I um, being a flight attendant or at least flight attendant training is not for the faint of heart it is an emotional roller coaster and um, it is tough like there's there's a lot of studying there's a lot of things we need to know there's a lot of technical stuff it's um, there's a, a lot of 
cool things though. It's a totally new for me. So there's been a lot of um, like study groups and getting together and that kind of thing. Um, not a lot of sleep because we've been working very, very long days. We start really early in the morning. Today, for example, I had to catch the bus at 4.30. Um, so I was up at three and tomorrow we get to sleep in. I don't have to catch the bus till 5.30. So I'm so excited. <laughs> I just came home and threw a bunch of popcorn in my mouth though. So I'm just chewing. Anyway, I just wanted to check in with you guys. And for those of you who have been watching and know what's going on, um, everything is going very well. It, it's like I say, it's been an emotional roller coaster. We had a big exam today. I was so nervous going in because it's the first of the exams and um, I passed with flying colors, so I'm very excited about that. It gives you a little boost of confidence because, you know, you don't know what you don't know in any, any way, but they kept saying, trust yourselves. Like you guys really do know this stuff. So anyway, that's that, I'm very excited. So I am going to treat myself. I do have homework tonight and I do have some videos I need to start to edit to get out so I can share more of my stuff with you guys. But um, I am gonna just take a, like an hour or so and nap and maybe even go by the pool. There's a pool at our hotel, so I might go hang out by the pool just a little bit and sort of like catch up and, um, and give myself a little treat. Anyway, so that's what I'm doing. Um, the kids are at home. This is Ryan's homecoming week. I'm missing homecoming week. I'm so bummed about that, but Mike and Ryan have been um, been staying in touch with me to let me know. Katie just found out today what she got in the circus. She went through her two circus tryouts and she just found out today, she sent me a text. She said, the list is out, but I haven't heard back from her. I don't know what it is that she's gonna be doing. So maybe I'll have her ask her to um, share it in a vlog so you guys can see what she's up to. Brennan is doing great. He was selected a couple different leader for a couple different leadership positions in his fraternity. Um, and I believe that the new, um, pledges are coming in this week and he is a pledge coordinator i think is what it's called there's a junior coordinator senior coordinator he's one of the senior coordinators so that's awesome for him leadership what up tube it's brennan just shave look a little younger whatnot just got a haircut we're gonna put that away a little short on top it's my little cole what's up what up cole it's cole's birthday today so we're gonna go get some din din whatnot i'm doing a little um Homework here. We we'll do a little uh, PGA whatnot, and then uh, oh, Brett turns 21 today, so we're gonna go to the fountain for Brett. So that's gonna be electric. Cole's still 20. We're the same age. Doesn't seem right. Doesn't check out. But um, yeah, that's the update from Tallahassee, Florida. Hopefully, I'll see you guys soon. Anyway, things are going great. So everybody's doing their thing. Ryan, um, I already told you about Ryan. Yeah, so anyway, that's it. I'm clearly mumbling, I'm going on and on about um, all of this, but I'm really tired, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a nap, and I will check in with you guys later. Thanks for watching. All right, rolling in. <laughs> we should get mom on the phone, totally. Because we already have no idea what we're doing. <laughs> Let's get into the department. No, we're, we're a couple of fashion we're gonna get one. <laughs> Roman men's section. Good thing. What, you gonna wear a white belt? Yes. I don't know. I really don't know. Huh. This is the first time I've ever gone into a dance not really having like a full picture in my head of it today. Hey, there's some ties. Hey. Ooh, snappy. Ooh, I can roll with a tire and four of those. Huh. That's tough. Alright, time to come off. Train right. <laughs> <laughs> ball on the phone. Doesn't help. Do it. Hi. In. <laughs> Hi guys. So, what we're looking at here is this suit from prom. We found yes. a bow tie that matches well with the suit, but in terms of matching with her dress, it's really hard. So, do you have a swatch of her dress or like a picture of her color? Yeah. Okay, you show me? So, you're saying it's hard to match that color? Yeah, I can send it to you. Okay. She's wearing gold. Hey, this is gold. So, well, there's... So there's a blue dress and then she's got gold shoes. Yeah, that's gold. That is gold. Oh, yeah. what is so that? that? That's like a, a flower you put on your lapel. Ah, that's cool. That is cool. All right. Look at that, Jilly. Oh. Uh, wait. All right. I need to ask them to take a look. Is this. Oh, cool. Right. Okay. Right. So. Goes I'm thinking lapel. blue and gold. Blue, white, gold. Right? Maybe like 
What? Yeah, right. <laughs> Maybe like a gold tie, Jill? A gold tie would be cool. Could you do a gold tie? Yeah, he could. Like, like gold or yellow? Gold. I guess. I don't know. Hold on. Yeah, I guess it's like gold or yellow. Okay. Yeah, I sent you the color of the dress. Okay, well, gosh, that matches your suit perfectly. Yeah, I think it will. Great, I think that would be a good idea, you guys. Mike, can I see the gold ties? Because I like the gold flower if you can't find a gold tie. Yeah, can uh, you do both? And should he do a bow tie or a, a regular tie, Jilly? Because he found out. A... You know, it's homecoming. So... So, so if there's any time to do a bow tie, it's right now. Is that right? Okay. Or at least that's what I think. Um, look, Jill, look at this. like a uh but her gold isn't really like a yellow gold it's more of like a platinum like a gold. shiny gold yeah it's more like a shiny gold this is still good though it's very nice it's a very nice tie i like what i got going here i don't know we'll, we'll figure it out and we'll call you back okay you can send the pictures too yeah I like, I like the you're going. okay I like what you're doing. thank so you so you decided against the white jacket yeah i think so Okay. So. Alright. But yeah, we'll okay, see what's good. Alright. Alright, have fun you guys. I can't wait to see how it all turns out. But Absolutely. feel free to call me back or send me pictures. Yep. Perfect. Love you. Love you more. Uh, Bye. Okay. Nice job. Thank you. Beautiful tie. Yep. White pocket square. Yep. It's gonna look good. Yeah, cool pair good. of shoes. Yep. Every girl's crazy about a shark dressed man. How about a haircut? That's a, a little short on that, on that front. That was fun. See how yeah. we get it done, Ryan. Uh, totally, totally. Okay, success from here. Ryan Ardo doing a great job. Um, doing some driving and doing some shopping and now doing some... Uh, bonfiring. Bonfiring. Yeah. Excellent. Thank that's, you. That sounds like a perfect Thursday. It's awesome. Yeah. So yeah, Thursday night football tonight as well. Yep. Yeah. So we, we called in a pro and I had mom help us out with the decision and yeah. uh, we got an awesome tie and we're going to look for a white uh, pocket square. Pocket square. And then you should be good. So yeah. yeah. Well done. Thank you. Excellent. Yeah. Back to mom. I wonder how she's doing. She's yeah. doing great. I heard she got like a 97 to She killed it. Woo! She killed it, Jess. Good job, Jilly. Let's get some sun, baby. It's time to go. Great, great, great day today. Lots happened. <clears throat> it's great to talk with Mike and um, Ryan. I don't know what he ended up getting for um, homecoming, but I do know that it's in two nights. <laughs> Tomorrow is the football game, and then the next night is his homecoming dance. So I cannot wait to see. I'm so bummed that I'm not going to be there. But I think Nan and Pap are going to come over and see Callie and Ryan, and of course, Mike will as well. They'll take pictures. I hope they take great pictures. <laughs> I'm not a control freak, but I do like to be there because I know exactly what I want. But anyway, I, um, I know they're going to have a good time regardless, Katie or Callie and Ryan. So that's great. I just wish I could be there with him, but that's okay. I'm doing my thing and, um, I will see him soon. Not too soon. Cause I don't want to leave here yet. <laughs> I want to be able to stay through graduation. Um, but soon enough. So hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Stay tuned to see, again, I'm just a flight attendant candidate. I'm not a flight attendant yet. I got the offer to be a candidate. So we're all candidates until we pass all the requirements and tests and all that stuff. There's a lot of, a lot of steps to it. So um, if I can make it through then in the next week and, wait, what's today? One, in the next two weeks, I could be graduating and be a full-fledged flight attendant. 
<laughs> so stay tuned to find out how that all works out. Um, and have a great night. Thanks so much for watching. Comment down below what made you guys happy today. What made me happy today was definitely passing my test. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.